Hi guys, good morning. Okay, so welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Vanessa's Televlog. <coughs> I'm sorry. <coughs> uh, God bless. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I, hindi ko na i-delete or i-cut out yung moment na hanaching ako kasi I seldom edit videos na guys kasi I don't have that much time to do that so ang ginagawa ko raw files siya so ito after ko ma-film in-upload ko na agad siya sa aking YouTube okay so today's video I am going to test test myself on how to read correctly okay I wanted to read this uh um, a story book or a fantasy book about a Cinderella okay because uh, they say that if you read uh, uh, stories or films loudly okay it will boost your pronunciation correctly and it will expound your uh, vocabulary so since I don't have time I'm done with my first class in the morning and I think I wanted to do this because I wanted to post an update in my youtube channel okay so today is a, a story a story today's story is about the cinderella okay bear with me okay if meron akong masalitang wrong uh, pronunciation it was then that uh, i learned it by reading okay not by hearing tada very good okay i know most of you or all of you knows already this kind of story or this story about Cinderella but I wanted to read for the uh, for the benefits of the young learner or those uh, students or kids na nanonood ng YT and they wanted to know the story about the Cinderella okay so much for those Hanash I'm going to start my reading about Cinderella Okay, so once upon a time, there was a kind girl named Cinderella. All of the animals loved her, especially two mice named Gaz and Zack. Okay, they do anything for the girl they called Cinderella. Cinderella lived with her stepmother and her two stepsisters, Anastasia and Drizella. They were very mean to Cinderella, making her work all day cleaning, sewing, and cooking. She tried her best to make them happy. Okay. Cinderella's stepmother, Lady Tremaine, was cold, cruel, and jealous of Cinderella's charm and the beauty okay so her stepmother was being jealous and that's why she was called cruel to cinderella okay so she enjoyed giving cinderella extra chores to do such as a bathing her cat lucifer okay or bathing her cat lucifer one day a messenger arrived with a special invitation there was going to be a royal ball at the palace the king wanted his son to find a bride every young woman in the kingdom was invited including cinderella oh cinderella is invited Cinderella was very excited about the ball. In the attic, she found a dress that had belonged to her mom. It was a bit old-fashioned, but Cinderella could make it beautiful. Lady Tremaine didn't want Cinderella to go to the ball. Oh, she don't like to allow. Cinderella to go to a ball what a cruel stepmom so she wanted a prince to meet Anastasia and Drizella maybe he would marry one of them Lady Tremaine kept the Cinderella busy with chores that would take her all night to finish okay 
While Cinderella was working, the mice and birds fixed her dress. They added ribbons and beads that the two stepsisters had thrown away. Okay. While working together, the animals turned a simple dress into a fabulous gown. Wow! Okay, Cinderella was overjoyed when she saw the dress. Okay, so she feel happy. Now she could go to the ball. Oh, thank you so much, Cinderella said to Goz and Zack and the birds. Okay. When the stepsisters saw their old ribbons and beads on Cinderella's dress, they flew into a rage. Okay. Hmm. They ripped the dress and pulled off the beads. Okay, they pulled off. Lady Tremaine didn't stop them. Okay. Cinderella's dream of going to the ball was through okay it is top oh she don't like to go to the ball already cinderella ran away to the garden to cry okay she's crying suddenly her fairy godmother appeared okay oh it appeared with a wave of her hand she turned a pumpkin into an elegant coach oh wow <clears throat> Cinderella could now go to the ball, but her dress was still ruined. Okay, it is being destroyed by her two step sisters. Beep, 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 and bee bee do boo. Okay, so that is the sound of the fairy godmother waving her wand again wand okay the magic wand cinderella was now wearing a beautiful gown and sparkling glass slippers oh very good but all of this came with a warning a warning when the clock struck midnight midnight means it's it's 12 o'clock okay the magic spell would wear off wear off means it will remove everything okay it will gone it will gone it will be disappear okay how about this one at the ball prince charming couldn't take his eyes off cinderella okay he couldn't take his eyes he's always looking at cinderella Okay, so the orchestra played orchestra and the prince began to dance with a wonderful girl whose name he still didn't know. Okay, so he still don't know what is Cinderella's name. For Cinderella, the night was a dream come true. Okay, so for Cinderella, it was a dream come true. He or she is dreaming for it. Okay, and it became true in one night. Okay, so before too long, the clock began to strike midnight. Okay, so it will approach or coming to 12 o'clock midnight okay it is turning to midnight okay so goodbye said the cinderella hurrying away okay so she is running away <clears throat> come back yelled prince okay so the prince is calling cinderella come back come back okay i don't even know your name no oh. So the prince uh, don't know the name of Cinderella yet. As Cinderella fled, one of her glass slippers came off. Okay, so one of her slippers slipped off into his or her foot. Okay, the prince sent the Grand Duke to find the girl who fit the glass slipper. Okay, so the glassy slipper was found by prince okay <clears throat> and he want to find who is the girl that fits the glassy slipper okay so lady tremaine that is who is lady tremaine lady tremaine is the stepmother of the cinderella of the cinderella of cinderella 
Okay, Lady Tremaine locked Cinderella in the attic. Oh, she locked her up. But Cinderella's mouse finds freed her. Oh, so the mice freed Cinderella. Then Lady Tremaine tripped the Grand Duke and the glass slippered shattered. Oh, shattered. But Cinderella had the other in her pocket and it fit. Okay. Cinderella and the prince were soon married. Everyone rejoiced, including Cinderella's mouse friends, who wore special outfits to the wedding. So in the end, they got married. Okay. No matter how much Lady Tremaine, her stepmother, do to avoid Cinderella and it didn't succeed, okay? Filled with joy, Prince Charming and Cinderella lived happily ever after. Okay, so that is how the story of Cinderella ended. Okay, they live happily ever after. Okay, so that ends our vlog for today. And for those who like our story, just uh, click the <laughs> the thumbs up and don't forget to click subscribe and that notification bells for you to get notified whenever and whatever and wherever whenever I post a video. Thank you for watching guys. Bye bye.